This is a script that takes a search term of your choosing and pulls in relevant YouTube videos along with their channels. It takes that data and puts it into a Google Sheet so that you can prioritize your YouTube research watch list using key metrics like views, subs, likes, comments, and age. It does this by leveraging Google App Scripts, a free to use cloud IDE, and taps into the YouTube Data API. This is literally the fastest way for you to pull in relevant data from YouTube into a spreadsheet for analysis. And hey, let's face it, ain't nobody got time to be sitting there copying and pasting data into a spreadsheet if they can help it. To be honest, I thought I was doing pretty well. You know, for a guy who's been making videos with whatever free time I had outside a full-time job and my family. But then this person mentioned that I should have more views and subs than I currently do. Wait, what? So I did a light search for, you know, the topic that I usually cover Google Apps Scripts. And lo and behold, when I looked at the results, there are a lot of folks with tons of views, thousands and thousands of views and thousands of subscribers which to be honest was pretty discouraging to me and i'm not very proud of my initial reaction to all of this it wasn't very good but after i pulled myself back together i knew i had to figure out what they were doing differently for me the problem though was that there are so many videos to go through so I started writing down the channel names, visiting the pages, copying down stats, tried to find their top videos and did a bunch of other stuff. And let's be real, that's a ton of manual work and it's really hard to summon the motivation when you're already pretty much discouraged. I knew there had to be a better way than doing it manually, which gave me the idea to scrape the YouTube search results to get a list of videos along with some helpful stats to help me prioritize which videos to watch first. And that led me to the YouTube Data API, which is really easy to use if you're using Google Apps Scripts because it has an add-on service just for YouTube, which means you can start calling YouTube data without needing any API keys or any of that. Now, the first API endpoint we're gonna hit is the search.list API endpoint, which is essentially the same thing as if you were going to do a search on YouTube, just that it's in an API form. The second API endpoint is videos.list, which we're gonna to use to get the metrics for the video because search.list won't give you the video stats. The third and final endpoint is channels.list, which we're going to use to grab the subscriber count, publish date, and all that about the channel itself, which is essentially gonna be your competitors. And once we're done with the code, it's gonna look like this. It's gonna output into two different tabs. I've also set it up so that you can pull in more than 50, uh, pull up to like a thousand, different videos as well as channels if you want it. Now the code is a little bit complex, so I'm not gonna show it up on the screen. However, I have packaged it up nicely for anybody who wants that code. In fact, I've made three different versions of it. One of them is just the source code, another one with instructions on how to install it, and then a third one with a video walkthrough for those of you who aren't familiar with coding but really wanna utilize this to help yourself in your journey on YouTube. And back to the list, there's a lot of videos for me to go through, and even though I've saved myself hours of copying and pasting time, there's no type of automation that'll make this next part go faster, which is actually watching these videos and learning from them. <sighs> Holy cow, that was a lot of YouTubing. Man, I don't even know how many videos I watch. I mean, it started off with videos about the same topic as what I cover. And then I started branching out to how to make good videos, which led me to channels like vidIQ and Film Booth, and that eventually brought me to Patty Galloway and Ludwig and Mark Rober, which by the way, amazing content. That guy's just like, he's killing it. You know, without this script, I would have probably spent a lot of time watching YouTube videos that weren't the best ones for me to watch. So having the script helped me prioritize it. And I think that it's gonna help you as well. So check down below, I'm gonna leave a link to how you can access the same code and run that for yourself. As far as the future of bootstrapping tools goes, I'm really excited. Uh, after learning everything that I have, it's going to be absolutely legend. Wait for it.